Bro, come on, really? Jukins too? Man, college football news. This time of the year, it don't stop. Now, Ohio State got the best running back in the transfer portal. Quinn Sean Jukins. It's crazy. Because look what happened. Ohio State lost their quarterback. Kyle McCord, starting quarterback. He left and transferred to Syracuse. Then they go get Will Howard, a real good quarterback from Kansas State. And then they pick up the top running back in the transfer portal. When Sean Jukins. Look, the big schools don't really take losses like that. They don't. All they do is reload. You got a, one of the top quarterbacks in the transfer portal, and you got the best running back, arguably, in the country in Quinshawn Jukins. Now, it don't matter. doesn't matter how they was able to get Quinshawn Jukins that quickly. Put his name in the transfer portal last week. Found a home in, what, six or seven days? So, I know there were some negotiations. Sean Jukins is going to the NFL after this year anyway. So he might as well get the biggest bag possible for his last season, his last college football season. But uh, like I said earlier, the, these big power fives, they just reload, man. That's all they do. Now, Ohio State's going to be a top five football team again in 2024. All they do is reload. Most teams, when they lose a, a real good quarterback, it's hard to replace them in college and the NFL. And Ohio State has not missed a beat and won't miss a beat. They're going to be top five again in 2024. They got a running back that gained over 1,000 yards his first two seasons in college. 15 plus touchdowns in his first two seasons of college. Watch out for Ohio State. Then again, you can say that every year. Where are you going, Eagles fan? To a funeral. Who died? The Philadelphia Eagles. I'm sorry for your loss. Thanks. Francis Ngannou, Anthony Joshua, March 9th in Saudi Arabia. Somebody getting knocked out. I do not see that fight going the distance. Yeah, somebody getting knocked out.